Entourage finally hits theaters. The long-awaited release is our Toyota People Pick of the Day. But did you know another special day just passed? That's right, the world just celebrated National Turtle Day. But when Jerry Ferreira, who plays Turtle in the show and the movie, stopped by the People Now Studios, he told me he didn't even know the day existed. Check it out. I, well, I was not aware until I woke up that day and I checked my Twitter timeline <laughs> to find some amazing photos that uh, you guys out there in Twitterland decided to send yeah. to me, say, wishing me a happy Turtle Day. I think it's kind of cool that I am now part of that yeah, day. Yeah, officially. Has, has it spawned maybe some creative ideas for celebrating next year, now that you're aware of it? Uh, it makes me say, like, maybe I could parlay this. I, I should have been in, you know, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2. Like, okay. how did I get that phone call? I think that would be a good thing. And that is a perfect segue into our second prerequisite themed question. Ding. Teenage Mutant, Mutant Ninja Turtles, which one would you be if they make that call? I got to imagine for sure I'm a Michelangelo. Cowabunga! Stoner of the group. <laughs> Just Love makes sense. pizza, cowabunga. Okay, like yeah, an entourage uh, tur Ninja Turtle mashup. I, I can see it. I think a lot of the characters you know, would I have can to actually break. We actually do fit well with the Ninja Turtles. Uh, I feel like Leonardo would be a great uh, Vince. Yeah. Raphael okay. would be a great E. Yeah. And of course, no, I'm sorry, Raphael would be <sighs> drama with the anger. Okay, issues. yeah, yeah, yeah. And, uh, and then uh, Master Splinter. Well, Ari. Ari has to be that. And then who? Splinter Shredder. Shredder. He could kind of be a hybrid. The hybrid character. You're very svelte. You have trimmed down? What's the secret? I, you know, I try to really uh, say it was for a role. It wasn't. <laughs> I'm not De Niro, obviously. <laughs> then I even tried joking around saying it was a fat suit all those years. It clearly wasn't. I think it's even better that it's not for a role. This was like a personal decision you yeah, made. Right? It really I mean, was. Real no. stuff. I was, uh, I was just about to turn 30 and I took a physical. And like the Hollywood physical when you're getting ready to start a job. I'm not going to say it's a joke because I don't want to offend the doctors, but they just try to make sure you're not dying. Yeah, right. Like if you could speak coherently go make a movie and this one doctor one time sort of just broke it down you know I was 200 pounds I'm 5'7 when I'm lying and uh, <laughs> he just said he said it's gonna be so much harder when you're 39 and you know maybe you will have a wife and kids it's just you're 29 you have the time get in shape right, right. now it'll benefit you down the road so what'd you get away with and to end results how much did you lose uh, 50 Wow I shaved off 50 really impressive yeah.